the world of the Bionis, home to many unique and intriguing forms of life. This is an Alpon. Strong, cute, talkative, but not very bright. Nopons are very similar to Homs. The only difference is their physical appearance. And as you can see, Nopons are very hot. This one fella even has a big fucking harem. But he isn't very happy. As you can see, his penis is very small. Or should I say penises? What? You see, no pawns reproduce by hugging the female no pawns with their ears and sticking their legs inside of the female no pawn. Yes, they are penises and legs at the same time. How can you explain this flat piece of belly on Riki, you idiot? I mean, very nice person. Hey, how are you doing? Anyway, before the male no pawn sticks his legs inside her, he must of course ask for consent. They do this by proving they are worthy of the fuck. Unless you are Riki, because he is the absolute chad. To prove that they are worthy, they must undergo a sacred no pawn dance. Just like birds, only weirder and with more plot. Riki, Here we see two no pawns in the Riki, crush enemy. Sure. are fighting Riki, over a me. As you can see, this Nopon was far too weak to stand up to the macho aura of the other and is crowned the bestest. All go to plan. He perished admirably. Ricky, make you. And they have now <sighs> consummated their relationship. Ha! Ha! Ricky! <gasps> Ryan got the stupid. No way! Some Nopon are of higher status than others. Among their tribes, they are referred as Hiropon. These unique Nopon have a duty to slay their malicious prey, the Dino Beast. Tatsu, the absolute mad lad, killed 100 Dino Beasts in just one hour. Gotta show how strong they are. Although, he might have cheated a little, but perhaps not. These creatures have been found even with use of leisurely activities. Homs and Hyantia have developed sport in which Nopon are used in a similar fashion to a ball. The activity known as Volleypon. Nopon as a species have a unique dialect, not too unlike that of the Hyantia or Homs. However, one large difference is that these Nopon make lesser use of certain grammar and emphasize their use of nouns. Nopon have been seen capable of some incredible feats. One of which being the ability to manipulate ether and attack using said ether. Others have developed powerful weapons such as the vicious boom biter, shields capable of projectile fire and many others. Nopon are interesting creatures. Some developed machines to aid them as seen in the following footage. Though, the use of these machines cannot be apparent to outsiders, perhaps of dubious intent, or simply innovative. It can only be a secret, an art that is exclusive to their kind. They are cunning creatures, they are tactical, and are masters of the blade and gun. They also are able to enchant women with their attire. This helps them lure their prey closer. Their prey are fuckweaves. <laughs> Look at this epic, handsome boy. <laughs> oh wait, we are still. No puns for one have created the first artificial blade. Very impressive. However, Nopon have also contributed the most to society by providing Poppy QTPI and, I mean, merchants. You see, merchants have the amazing power of manipulation. 
These unstoppable little beings have been through more danger than any mortal could ever imagine. Through the depths of hell, inside the stomach of big monsters, they are unstoppable. Their only weakness is not being able to fuck. Rest in peace, my pet Nopon Coral. Never being able to succeed. I still miss you. Nopon make their habitat in many areas, however. It is uncommonly known that the black species originates from the Bionis back, a warm jungle known as Makana Forest. The forest that is well known to be making rain sweatier than a brog's armpit. Brog's armpit. We'll have to they have colonized within a large tree. The natives refer to as Frontier Village. It seems the Nopon have been seen migrating to new worlds and universes through strange means. Why this event has been occurring is still yet unknown. Perhaps they mean to reach new planets. The origin of these majestic life forms is still also unknown. Perhaps these creatures are a divine gift alike to our home, the Titans, or maybe the culmination of years of trading. However, there has been a myth that they have their own god, and a titan, himself known as the Noponus. The divine biter, known as Nopondo, is known that it cannot be wielded by any Nopon, but by the Heropon, and it is believed to be the weapon of FUCK that can come with anything with 30% chance. Even so, stronger than the Minado, the sword of the Bionis. Perhaps they evolved from crabs, as they have two penises, and also rave very hard. But some say they are descendants of a god, being able to seduce every creature that exists of this place we call Bionis. Some of these creatures have been known to make contact upon the ominous Maconis on a quest as Herobon. Local gossip of the creatures say that Herobon can slay God himself. However, this is mere heresy when yet another brave Herobon, sword in hand, destroyed the Aegis that pillaged the land 500 years ago. Despite all this, no puns are endangered species. Their courage and heroism pays the biggest price in most of the cases. No pun always forget they can't swim and drown because of it. In summary, no pun are creatures of the wild who are beyond our understanding. The only way we can explain them is... Napon. Man, do I miss my family. I lost him to an Opon. His name was Banner. They said he was rich and that I didn't spend enough time and money maintaining the family. What is my fault? I got kidnapped. And only to get to Zoom my children once a week. <laughs> they won't even pay me enough money for a mic. Pyro, let me out of this basement, please, Pyro. Oh, God, oh, fuck, he's coming. Run. I've been hiding, hiding with him ever since. Since I forgot. Help. Help, he's on his way. I haven't seen the sun in days. No water, no food.